Ball with 13.05 to go in the second quarter. We're tied at three here at the Boston Garden. Ringers with a point blank shot. Goes high. Great play from Cameron. Another guy with great eyes. He had the feed right in the cylinder. Just missed. Tavares working one on two. Centering pass. Mahar set that high over the glass. Mahar right away checks his pocket. That baby went right out of his stick, was launched. He right away checked the pocket to see what was wrong. Thought it was a technical error instead of operator error? Yeah, that was disavowing any blame personally from him. Bruce Chan and Chuck. Neil Ringers. Toby Boucher bringing it back over to Chan and Chuck with six on the shot clock. His shot won't go. New 30-second clock. Hilt picks it up, and Hilt, I don't know if he's trying out for the Bills or not with that soccer-style kick. Well, he went after that ball. He situation. He gives up the possession, but he wants to settle it. This is an unfiddled situation that could be very dangerous. He doesn't have a stick even. So kick it out of there, give the ball to the other team. He goes back and gets his hardware. I've done indoor soccer in my day, but I've never seen a move like that with all that equipment. How do you like the, uh, the technique? Keller with a shot. Tries a follow-up and a... Leveling hit, courtesy of Darius Kilgore. Frazier steals the outlet pass, and here come the Blazers. Boston's had a very good game plan, a lot of cutting, a lot of motion. Boucher with a shot, stick save by Cowie, loose in front of the crease. Jerry Hill's trying to pick it up this time with his stick. Tavares with a hit away from the ball, that'll be a loose ball push. Hiller off the restart, and watch the hitting, the contact on the side. Boston not giving anybody any room to carry the ball to Buffalo responding. Buffalo responding with a lot of contact like this. Wham! Kilgore comes in and levels the player from Boston. Those two will not forget that contact. Watch for those two, Kilgore and Keller, as the game progresses. A penalty has been assessed to John Tavares. And the Blazers will be in a power play when we return. 3-3, second quarter action on Prime Network. Didn't have to last long. And it was a one-on-one -on -one move by Randy Frazier, coach's son out of Springfield. Watch him bring it in. The defense doesn't come out and make contact. The defense playing a little bit of his own because they're man down. Watch. He reads it, splits the seam, and right over the right hip, or the left hip as you look at it, right for Randy Frazier. There he is, first score of the second period, that one-goal lead. Ten minutes to go in the half as Derek Keenan moves in, puts it to the Ooh. back of the net. Totally overmatched Chris Cameron. Keenan, when he wants to go to the goal, you can see it's going to take more than one player to stop him. Keenan leading this team. That's the second goal of the night. And he answers that other goal within one minute. Here he comes. Cameron can't stop him. He comes in, makes Dan O'Neill commit. Makes Dan O'Neill stand up. He goes behind him. Watch. Stick high on the shot. So O'Neill goes high. When he does, he drops it over a little bit lower. Left side of the goalie. Keenan on a mission. The technician against what some people call the brute. Talmo against Alexander on the faceoff. Got a 30, 40 pound weight difference here in these two guys. Alexander's got all the experience. Talmo, 200 pounds, six feet. Talmo able to knock it out, but it's the bandits that come up with the ball. Hall finally gets control, trying to get it in front. Alexander takes it himself, takes the shot. O'Neill picks it up with a stick, sends right. it long. Greg, they'll be tired now. That was a tough defensive ring. If we can get that, I say ring because I see Ringers has the ball, but if the team from Boston can go ahead and push the offense now, a great chance against a tired defense, especially Alexander right there, number 26. Here's Toby Boucher against Alexander. Boucher sends it up top for Ringers. Seven on the shot clock. Ringers with a shot from the outside. Stick save, Cowie. Frazier sends it high. Very high. I think they were so intent on working against Alexander, thinking he'd be tired, which he was. He, you can see both knees heavily taped. The years have taken their toll on Alexander. So they set up that one-on-one -on -one and got themselves out of a good shot. Tavares with a shot. Nice save, almost with a glove there by O'Neill. Bissell tries to redirect it into the net. Can't do it. Outlet pass, Chanachuk. Bruce Chanachuk in the corner. Tom Carmian, left-handed shot. 
He's a natural righty from University of Massachusetts, but look at this left-handed shot. Cowie's saying, come on, guys, put some of that aluminum on him. Tremendous play from one of the leaders on the team. You dish it right back up top. Carmine comes in. He's got some room, so watch him just switch to the left. He's shooting right in the cylinder and just beeline right for that white net. Great target shooting here by Carmine. Nobody in front to screen the goalie. He saw a target, and he hit it. 5-4. The Blazers with, I believe, their first lead. Second, they were up 4-3. That's correct. So I refer to your score sheets. 8.25 to go. Ball loose in front of the Boston net. Loose ball push. And what was a one, maybe two on four situation goes to the advantage of the Buffalo Bandits. A push from behind once again, this time by Francis. Here's a look at the save down here. Coming right down, Kilgore drops it low, and O'Neill read it perfectly. You see, he didn't drop to his knees. He just got it with a stick. He didn't sacrifice any of the upper real estate. He didn't give him a target. He just stood his ground. Off the restart, Bill Mahar against Talmo. Tried the centering pass. Somehow it gets to Tavares. Off the boards, Bissell takes it. Looks for the centering pass. Tried to get it to Hilt, but I think O'Neill got a stick on it. See Roy Condon there to the left of the screen. The referee at one point today will show you his wrists. They were both broken last game here. He's got them all heavily wrapped. He tripped on this carpet. He went down and fractured both of his wrists. He is just getting back to where he can have a soft cast on him. Ouch. Ouch is right. Penalty now. Power play for Buffalo. Second one of the game. Each team has had one power play opportunity. Each team has scored from an opportunity. Tom Carmian goes into the box. 